But let's get into Diet Pepsi really quick, okay? Because this is a total banger. Tell me about the creative process and how this all came together. Um, oh my gosh. It, I wrote the song um, with these two girls, Luca and Elvira. They're great friends of mine now. But at the time, I had just met them and we worked together for the very first time. And we actually made the song the first time we met and worked together, which was really crazy. But we knew there was something really magic and electric kind of after that first day and then yeah you know now it's in the world which is really crazy and it feels like it feels like a baby is <laughs> birth and i'm like oh my god where is my baby like it's not mine anymore <laughs> you know but it's it's such a nice rewarding feeling to see everybody really connecting with it oh totally are you watching all the tiktoks with people creating with it yes <laughs> of course of course do you ever watch a tiktok and you're like this is awful <laughs> yeah <laughs> definitely i mean yeah, you watch anything and you're like, this is awful sometimes, you know, but then when it's good, it's really good. So that's true. That's yeah. true. But tell me also about working with Charlie XCX. You've been collaborating with her quite a bit. Yeah. Von Dutch remix uh, to die for being on the road with her. How has that helped you or shaped you as you grow into an artist in your own right? Um, she's really given me so much confidence and I owe so much flowers to her, honestly, because she's given me um, not only like incredible advice in the industry and incredible guidance and direction and and just taste, honestly, she has such amazing taste and has given me such, you know, a, a, an eye into that when she is working and, and anything that we did together was so, it was so nice to see her perspective on those things and really see someone who's been such an incredible artist and so respected for so long. I mean, she's been writing, she's written so many hit songs in her life, you know, whether that's for herself or for other people. And it's really just so inspiring to see someone always um, evolve and, and change and grow and like really follow their heart and not sacrifice her artist, you know, artistry for anybody. And just really, it's like, you know, if you get it, you get it. And if you don't, you'll get it eventually mm -hmm. kind of thing. And she's been such a uh, champion for me. And that's been really, really kind. And you know, I just love her so much. And she's an incredible light in the studio and, and really fun to work with. Nice. Sick. Yeah.